Hey there everyone, welcome back to another day in the life. So I'm just running a little bit late, going to be going to pick up Chris and then we're heading out to go register for the World Roundup Skateboard Contest. And I'm rocking my new Finley hat. Thanks Finley Hats, appreciate that. And if you ever guys haven't seen the unboxing video, go check it out, it's awesome. There's more than just a hat with Finley Hats. So let's go pick up Chris, uh, I'll film once we're down there to register and then we'll have some time to like maybe get some skate clips of everyone. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. It's the first day. You guys can actually watch it live on theworldroundup.com. So you guys can check that out as well. And the last day, Rodney frickin' Mullen's supposed to be showing up. Woo! Alright, guess who I'm with, guys? PewDiePie. Let me fix my hair. PewDiePie. We're PewDiePie. That's who we're with. PewDiePie, too. <laughs> yeah, brah. What a dude. We're PewDiePie. Now what we're gonna dude. go register. So we'll film over there. Alright, so we just showed up at the hotel here. I forget what hotel it is, but yeah, we're here to uh, register and uh, basically get our goodie package. Goodie package! Yeah, Goodies! Goodie package! The pool! Chris is gonna go for a swim. So we're the first people down here. Monty's not even here. We're the only ones here. Look, they got complimentary coffee. And look, this Tazo box. It's got all sorts of different red rose and earl grey. How do you like your coffee, good sir? Well, sir, I like my coffee black. Black as the night sky. With a pound of sugar. Also, a shout out to Finley Hats for hooking up a sick hat, sticker, and bump cap. All right, so they changed the registration from the hotel to the actual curling rink where we skate. So we've been waiting for like 20 minutes and then found that out. So now we're actually gonna be heading to the curling rink to register. And uh, thanks to Linger for calling Monty and figuring that out. So uh, we're gonna head over there, register, and uh, yeah, we'll film once we're there. All right, so we are officially in the world roundup right now. We're gonna go register and to go this massive launch ramp by Skull Skates. This is insane. Insane? Yeah, yeah. In the world roundup. Yeah. Rodney Mullen's supposed to show up. It's gonna be nice. Everyone's busy getting registered. Guess we're gonna have to get registered. Guess who's here? And I ran into Rick McCrank. It's so awesome. What's up? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you guys gotta go check out Rick McCrank if you guys don't know who he is, because. Uh, yeah, he's an old school skater, but he's really talented. Go check it out. It's so sick. Yeah. It's so nuts that Rick McCrank's here. But yeah, we're uh, just signing up to register. You can see there's like all these people, all these crazy skaters, AMs, professionals. As as I can see. All right, so I got my Finley bump cap in, and it ties up like so, so it's like a helmet with a hat, which is cool. Chris and I just got our goodie bags with lots of stuff. I'll show you guys later what's in our goodie bag. So what do you yeah. think that about Rick McCrank being here? It's so cool, eh? Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't expect him to be a fucking freestyle man. I know, and he's, enter and he's entering amateur too, which is pretty and awesome. And skating amateur, yeah. 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 So that's pretty wild. It's pretty gonna wild. Be, it's going to be off the hook. Yeah. Off the hook? Yeah. All right, so I got this Spacebound Finley sticker from Finley Hats. I'm going to put it on my skateboard to represent while I'm at this world freestyle event. And I'm going to be wearing their hat every day. Uh, I guess the best place to put it would be up right about here. Uh, I might get some wheel bite, but it's it's better than any other spot, I'd say. So I got my Space Bound Finley sticker. Space Bound Finley sticker. Alright, so we're back in the world freestyle. Everyone's skating. Everyone's practicing. We got Riley here. What's up, Riley? <laughs> Everyone's practicing, getting their runs and warm up. So I'm going to go practice too. Wish me luck. Alright, so we're doing a uh, skaters meeting right now. Kevin Harris, all the skaters, 62 skaters, with my fellow Canadian skaters. Hey, we got Team Canada. Team Canada represent. Where's Alan? Alan, um, where's Chris? Chris is over there. Traitor. No. <laughs> like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Woo! Guys, I think we're gonna start a daycare center. <laughs> yeah, no, daycare freestyle center. There's so many young guys here. It's pretty cool to see. Um, so as I go through all this, there's a lot of really cool stuff that we're gonna be bringing up uh, tonight. So we're okay, now please, just we starting the preliminary amateur. 
All right, we're getting ready to get started with the amateur uh, preliminaries here at the World Roundup. These guys are just for placing. Here we go, let's see what he's got. Fast footwork on it, no-handed pogo. Wow, look at that control right there from the no-handed truck stem. And he's gonna spin it around the opposite way. Oh, doing the moonwalk in the back, man. Checking it out. He's got 15, wow. 15 right now, he's going up into a truck stand pogo. Right in, yeah. Out of that butter flip. Watching the amateur division. Oh, this is a cool song. This is the only girl competing this weekend, AJ? Only girl. Only girl out of 65 other guys. guys. She, she's been to bring it. I watched her in uh, practice. She's got it. Yeah, nice smooth footwork. Up and over. Yeah, coming off the side, get it. Yeah, with that finger flip, yes! Rocking that moonshine shirt. Moonshine, one of the sponsors of today's event. And all weekend, yeah, nice little combination right there, right into it, nice. 360 combinations, 360 shoving combinations, meaning spinning the board laterally. Big representation from Japan this year. I think there's 14 of them here. That's amazing, right there with that nose. Manual to shove it. Pressure yeah. flip, yes! The only girl in this competition, 15 you guys. Seconds. Here, 15, 15 seconds. Nice. Wow, Biggie nice. Big Spin what? Clip. Nicely done. You got that. Oh, last trick, last trick. That is gonna be time. Let's hear it for you guys. Let's oh. get it up for the videos. Age 30. Yeah, that's it. Really technical footwork, check this out. We cross footing, yeah, right into the next. Nice. Looks like he's riding a jet skateboard. There he goes. Is that a level bread? Yeah. Yeah, it's going to a big spin, like a mini big spin. One right after another, don't comply with any. No switch, right now going the opposite way. You do the switch, you do Yeah, end overs. Nicely done. my skateboard nothing's wrong right wait a minute what's this look at this <laughs> it's brutal
Pearls, these guys are competing for $10,000 in prize money. Grab a good seat on the stand. Yeah, they're trying to make it to the top tomorrow.
Alright, so we're done at the World Freestyle Roundup for the first day of actually competing. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, let's go get beers. Beers and pizza. Uh, we're with Alan and Chris, and we're gonna, I'm gonna go drop them off, and then uh, I guess uh, we'll go back home and you do some shoutouts. Uh... Alright, so I just got home, and the police are here. It's home sweet home. Oh, home sweet home. How's it going, guys? <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna relax and eat my dinner. Caesar's or little. No, no, it's Domino's pizza, my bad. Thanks, mom and dad. Yeah, Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> All right, so after I finished eating dinner, I got really lazy, came upstairs, and passed out. So this is actually uh, a little while after uh, I filmed that video. Anyways, that was just a small preview of some of the skaters. I'll probably end up doing like a recap video of the World Roundup of like all the skaters, little clips here and there. But anyways, mm -hmm. let's do some fan clips or some shoutouts. So we only have one technically fan clip, not fan clip, and also one shoutout from the last day. So let's do the shout out, which is actually from the Thursday Club. Yeah. And it says, he says, great vid, Chad. Some of that freestyle was sick. I landed my first kickflip the other day on my mate's 8 inch deck. Decided to buy one and now can't land one bloody pissing me off. I've gone from a 9 inch deck down to an 8. I will get these bloody things if it kills me. Also, that kid who dropped in at Bell, you, you had that man just lean forward a bit more and it's all yours. Uh, yeah, dude, I totally hear you. Um, I'm sure you will definitely land it. Just practice makes perfect and getting your technique down. I will be doing some how-to videos on all the kickflip and all the tricks, so hopefully that will help you and everybody else. And that kid that actually dropped in, uh, I actually got to meet him. And, uh, yeah, no, I gave him props because not too many kids will actually try to drop in for their first time on something that big, so that was pretty impressive. So that's the only shout out we got, and it was from the Thursday Club. You! Next, I'm sure you guys have already seen this clip, but I'm going to play it anyways. It was actually filmed at the Cloverdale uh, skate park while the rodeo was going on. There was a cop that tried to cruise his bike into like the, like, the bowl area and completely ate it. So let's watch that quick. Oh! Are you? That is just so brutal. Like I guess all those donuts ended up uh, catching up to him because that f frame or the rim, not the frame, the rim of the tire. It as soon as it went into that bank, it just like crippled, and then you just flip that cop into a scorpion tail. That is just nuts. It's just insane. I can't believe I got that on camera. I also just wanted to say that I'm apologizing and I'm sorry that I haven't been uploading as much as I used to. I just haven't had the motivation to actually just sit down and edit my videos to upload them. I know you guys are probably wondering what's going on. I just, I don't know, I just haven't been feeling the same, like, you know, ever since my accident and everything. I just haven't really felt, you know, just like sitting around and, you know, doing my videos, which I should be, and being motivated to do that. So I just wanted to apologize for that, but I'll try to spend more time and try to get more motivated to get my videos out there so you guys can watch uh, the Day in the Lifes as well as the skate events and everything else that I'm, I've been doing. I'm sure you all can understand because when you like do something and you do a lot of it every single day, uh, like your guys' views, comments, and your guys' like loyal following like means a lot to me and I really appreciate that. But you know, I'm only, you know, it's like I spend a lot of time doing it all and I do it all by myself so it takes a lot of work and effort and in the end of the day after let's say a week of one video going if I'm lucky I might make like 20 cents off of it so I'm not not like compared to like any other mega like skateboarding youtuber out there so you know if I if, the, if obviously they have more motivation because they're making like a couple hundred to like a thousand dollars off each video so why wouldn't they want to post more videos all the time to make more money so I know everything's not about money, but the money makes the world go around. And I just wanted to say, you know, like I said, I apologize for not posting, but it's just, uh, I, I've been working on other stuff and doing other things, but hopefully I'll uh, end up getting back into that grind and getting that motivation to just keep pumping out videos every day for you guys' enjoyment. So I just want to say thank you so much to everyone who watches and supports me, and I'm basically going to end this day in the life on that, saying that. So you guys know what to do, and uh, I'll see you in the next day in the life. You know, comment for a shout-out, and uh, if you want to send me a fan clip, do it through Facebook or email. All right, peace out, everyone.